The Earth Pillars, or the Kish Forest. Let's go and see if we can find them. Hmm, it's quite muddy here at the car park. Let's hope the trails are in better state. So far, the trails don't look too bad. Don't know about my shaking hands though. Come back up. the view. This time we're closer to the river. That's the River Spey. You'll see it more clearly when we get down a level. We're coming the opposite way round this time. More trees, I know, but we're uh, turning down towards the river now. So there will probably not be many pictures until we get down close to the river because I'll be trying to hold on to something. <laughs> Trail that way goes back up to the gate near where we're far parked. And the gorge down there, you may be able to see as we turn around, there's a small stream flowing down to the spay. And what we've got straight down there, the other side of the trees, is technically an earth pillar, but it's overgrown and uh, has trees on it. Hopefully we'll get to see the clearer one, or ones, as we move along the trail. The river spay through the trees. Hopefully a clearer view. and a much clearer view at the viewpoint at this time of year, we hope. We were up there a minute ago. We're now down at the, probably the low point of the, the trail, but uh, we'll need to be back up there at some point. The fishermen's huts. Salmon season will be starting hmm, any day now, I suppose. And they'll all be out trying to catch the elusive fish. The sun, well, I suppose it's starting to set. It's uh, Low on the horizon. The Earth Pillars, Ordicus. This lovely wood is a maze of old paths and tracks, following the trail through pines and heather to discover steep sided Ordicus burn, great views and the dramatic red earth pillars. The short loop through the pines leads to the magnificent viewpoint overlooking the river Spey and the curious red earth pillars laid down by retreating glaciers thousands of years ago. It's actually easier to see the pillars from the other side of the river or as I've done in the past flying the drone 
Unfortunately, we didn't get to fly the drone this time and access to the other side of the river is now controlled by uh, a locked gate. So it's only possible to see those if you have access to that gate as a fisherman on the river spay. There are strange stones and rocky formations throughout the wood, deposited thousands of years ago by retreating glaciers. And of course, the earth pillars are part of that. The trail also rewards you with stunning views over the River Spey. In season, keep a look out for ospreys fishing in those waters. Just in the V there you can see the top of one of the earth pillars. Of course the best view from the other side, but that's not where we are. Look around. And the sun is giving a bit more glare.
So, what was Lindsay doing? Well, Lindsay was helping the forestry by clearing out the path. I'd waded through it, but Lindsay wanted the path clear. That's what she was doing. Thank you for watching Desmond's Dons. And remember, please take nothing but memories and leave nothing but tracks. Please subscribe and ring the bell for notifications and hopefully we'll see you next time.